Hello, it's Tori Ratcliffe here. I'm up in the Scottish Highlands visiting uh, Trees for Life's flagship estate, um, which is Dundragon. It's beautiful up here. There's lots of ancient woodland. Um, and I'm going to be speaking to the lovely Karen, who is going to fill us in on where the money raised from the squirrel prints has gone. Through this project, we've sold nearly 100 prints, which will tally up to nearly two and a half thousand pounds, yeah, which is amazing. So Karen, would you like to tell us a little bit about the work that you're doing with the Red Squirrels? Sure. So um, my colleague Becky is our squirrel lady. So um, what she's doing is translocating Red Squirrels. Mm -hmm. So we've got lots and lots of Red Squirrels, very healthy populations of them in the east of the Highlands. Um, but we've got areas of wild forest in the West Highlands where Red Squirrels have been lost. Mm -hmm. And because we've done a lot of work to restore those um, forests in the Western Highlands, they're now perfect habitat for Red Squirrels, but they can't get from east to west on their own so we give them a helping hand um, which involves Becky going out and setting up feeding stations so the red squirrels get used to coming to the feeding stations and then she'll go out and set a trap so they go in they get the peanuts and then they're caught in a cave very quick health check of the squirrels which involves measuring their tails and weighing them they're put into then a really lovely comfortable luxurious wooden box with lots of food and moss and straw and whatever and they're very quickly transported over to the west and um, we put the boxes up in a tree and just leave the squirrels who will, when they feel comfortable, they'll come out of the box and they're in a fantastic new habitat for them. And we've been very careful to make sure that we select sites that we know are going to suit the squirrels. So why have we lost so many of our red squirrels? I think it's probably a combination of things, just um, pressure on the forest, so there has been less and less forest, wild forest habitat, it's kind of shrunk in area. Um, we're trying to turn that around, so we're regenerating forest planting. Mm -hmm. We know that some of the red squirrels that we've released have already been breeding, so we've already got Fantastic. you know another generation of, of red squirrels. And a lot of that is down to this woman, because she just inspires people with Aww. her wonderful print. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you very much. Fantastic. <laughs>